goodness gracious. How about that birdie wow. in the last? And came back and went in. Clutch, clutch, clutch. With three career victories, Spieth's success is in large part due to his work on the greens. Ranking inside the top 10 in strokes game putting and birdie average this season. Not a bad resume for someone who graduated high school four years ago. For being 21 years old, he's by far more mature and more talented than I was at that age and, and more accomplished as a player than I was at that age. It's nice to have the respect of these guys that I've worked so hard to be able to play with on a weekly basis. This is my third year now on tour. I feel like I'm starting to get the gist of things. But Spieth isn't the only success story from the high school class of 2011. That away? <laughs> I can't hear you! After a successful college career at Alabama, Justin Thomas tasted victory as a pro for the first time in 2014 on the Web.com Tour. The resume is filled. What a year for this young man on the Web.com Tour. The victory locked up his PGA Tour card for this season. It would have been nice to play last year on the PGA Tour. At the same time, I think the stuff that a 21-year-old is going to learn playing a tour like the Web.com Tour is huge. There's no doubt he was going to be out here. He's incredible talent. So far in his rookie season, Thomas has four top tens, ranks second in total birdies, and is pound for pound one of the longest hitters on tour. Fellow rookie and 2011 grad Daniel Berger introduced his game to the golfing world with a second place finish at the Honda Classic. Yeah, Berger loves it. The 21 year old is sixth on tour in making birdie or better on the par fives, including the first ever albatross at the Arnold Palmer Invitational. That is the rarest of birds out here on the PGA Tour. Berger is ranked 22nd in the FedEx Cup standings with three top 10 finishes this season. I've got a long way to go, but just really enjoying the process and um, really taking in, you know, all that the PGA Tour has to offer. Certainly destined for the PGA Tour is Web.com Tour standout Patrick Rogers, who rounds out the stellar class of 2011. Here it is a really good young talent. Tied Tiger Woods for the Stanford record for most wins. Benefiting from a successful amateur and college career alongside Thomas and Spieth, the 22-year-old is third on the web.com tour money list after winning the Columbia Championship earlier this season. My game is ready. I feel like I'm physically ready. I feel like I'm mentally ready. And that's just a huge credit to Stanford. Um, they've developed me as a player and as a person much faster than I could have ever anticipated. But Rogers and the rest of the class of 2011 aren't the only headline makers in their 20s. World number one Rory McIlroy has nine career victories, including four major championships. Billy Horschel became the youngest FedEx Cup champion last season at 27 years old and has three career victories. And earlier this season at the Hyundai Tournament of Champions, Patrick Reed became the fourth player in 20 years to win four times before turning 24.